All right, so here we are back at the spot where I found a bunch of bullets right up there below that cliff and cliff, a cliff. And I think what was happening is there's a camp or something up on top there. And those are either thrown over or they're just kind of washing over uh, in the big rains and stuff and ending up in the water. So what we're going to do today is we're going to start about where I am at now. And we're going to hunt this cliff along, all along the base here. And hopefully right up to that spot and hopefully the soldiers might have pitched some cannonballs or muskets or bags full of gold coins or bullets over that cliff right there. Now, unfortunately, if you look up there, you can see there's all kinds of trash coming down where people have dumped trash more recently. All right, so wish me luck. I'm just hoping we can get a video today that we actually find a couple things. Um, I just don't know. What do you think? What are the chances? I think we'll find at least one bullet. If we find at least one bullet, I'll publish the... Uh, Ooh, something jump right there, some fishy. I'll publish the uh, video. Well, I have my first, what appears to be fired musket ball of the day. It might actually be cut, but I'm thinking that might be fi fired. Mm. The allergies are killing me today. Well, this gave me a good scare. Thought I had an artillery shell. Not exactly sure what it is really, but probably something off a railroad maybe or a mill. Big old heavy piece of iron, just the right size for a shell. This is really quite treacherous for walking in here. You can see all these ledges and stuff. I'm glad the water's a little more clear today. Otherwise, we'd be tripping like crazy. When we were here last time, it was quite cloudy because it was just after rain. After rain. Not really hearing too much. No good squeakers. Wow, that looks <laughs> crazy, isn't it? So, got nice cliffs. I mean, they could throw stuff off. We were finding the bullets. Actually, just around the bend, you, can, you can't quite see the water where we were. So we got a ways to go yet. I think we get across that. There we go. Uh. <laughs> well, there's only one step that was over my head. Kind of swing out there, listening for big iron. If we don't find cannonballs up close, or uh, musket balls up close to the bank, I'm not gonna worry about the deeps, those deep signals, unless they're cannonball signals. See, there's kind of some modern stuff down here some cable and I just found this thing which probably goes to that or something like it I just be really careful because there's a trip hazard in here but you know we've come a little ways haven't found too awful much but we got we got a good ways to go yet so don't give up yet you see why I want it to be a little more clear in here too there's a broken bottle right there I'm not gonna touch that thing come on cannonball A little bit of iron bleeping in there, but nothing great yet. Oh, that's a lovely find. Glad I have my gloves on. <laughs> well, we might have a bullet, so you might get to see the video. Let's go under and take a look. I already kind of, I've already uncovered it. I haven't picked it up though. This is a nice uh, sharp. You can see it's kind of worn down, but I'm pretty sure that's a Confederate one. Uh, the other ones we were finding were, um, I think, over in that area. So there's a chance we might find some more. Maybe a nice Confederate belt buckle. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? I don't know if you noticed where the bullet was, but in the same hole, there's a little um, fishing weight. This is a modern fishing weight. They both get caught in that little, little pressure area. I'm up just a few feet from where I found the bullet, and I've uh, found a couple sinkers already. Then I just found this. This is a little hoe, garden hoe. Um, well, you know, at first I thought it was like really modern. Maybe it is, because it's so lightweight. But those look like some pretty old rivets right there. Mm, that might be older. I'm gonna keep that for now, although I don't have high hopes in, of it being particularly old. But the rivets are strange, I think. A pretty good signal right here. 
All right, there are chances are it's gonna be fishing weight, but it's possible it could be a bullet. I'll put you under for this one, okay? Hold your breath. That's a nice little bullet right there. That's a uh, a Smith carbine, and that's a beautiful one. I mean, it's definitely not uh, been fired. That's been dropped. Looks almost like a little chest piece, doesn't it? <laughs> that's sweet. I haven't found one of those in a while, especially not in that great of shape. I didn't get you up for this one because it didn't read very high. But it's another. Uh, this is a fired bullet. The end of it looks kind of funky, doesn't it? it Look like a little creature looking at us, <laughs> a little snake or something. But I'm pretty sure that's just a fired bullet probably not civil war era but it's hard to say for sure nice little signal right here it could be a bullet let's see if indeed it is Are you ready Definitely was the right size, but just not the right shape. Didn't get you out because we're kind of in a little backwater here and it wasn't going to clear up. But it looks like a piece of, uh, I don't know if that's melted lead or a bullet that hit really hard, smashing onto the rocks here. Might be a bullet that kind of, that might be a base right there. I think that's the base. And that's just the flattened out part of it. Man, that was a hard hit though. Nice little find. I just found a little fishing lure. Fortunately, we're going downstream, so it's going to get all muddy. But if I get onto a big pile of gold coins, I'll uh, sit up on the bank, have a sandwich, and uh, wait for the water to clear. Okay, I've been bebopping around for a while. I haven't been finding too much, but I have a decent signal here that could be a bullet. And then I got something I have half excavated over there somewhere that I'm letting uh, the uh, silt and stuff clear up before I go get it. And we're going to look at that together. But let's check this thing out first. It could be a bullet, could be a sinker. I'm not sure which. Um, I haven't uncovered it yet, so I can't see it. Let's go under. That's just a big old piece of flat iron, isn't it? Let's go look at the other thing I have over here. Somewhere over here is a big rock. Oh, there we go. I think it's a sign of some sort. I don't know if it's going to be complete, or old, or whatever. Ah, uh, no. What do you think? You know what it is? What kind of sign? It looks like it's broken though, isn't it? That letter's missing. screaming when we see this one <laughs> let's see what we got here the purest kind some type of ice cream we all scream for ice cream she'll take the ring from your hand and bury it in the sand and keep it for eternity mother earth she's got her secrets she's promised to keep hidden in her dirt or 